you wake up, this is what you gotta do. You gotta crush the day before it crushes you. Every day I'm here to motivate, lead the way in the AM. I don't want you to hear these words, I need you to feel what I'm saying. Oh, no. you gotta crush the day before it crushes you. You gotta crush the day before it crushes you. In the building, Jimmy Wilson, motivation's coming, I can feel it. First thing that you need to do is crush the day before it crushes you. Play the game to win, but never cheat yourself to get there. This is something that I think as an entrepreneur, as a success-driven individual, as someone who just sets high expectations for themselves, you're going to deal with wanting to get there faster, wanting the results now, that instant gratification. And it's not your fault. That's just the world we live in at this point. You know, we carry around these mobile devices that can literally get us information in the blink of an eye. And what we tend to see watching social media and seeing these people pop up and become, you know, what look like overnight celebrities and and just become stupidly rich out of nowhere, you know, we think, I want to get there faster. I want that. Why is it not happening for me? And, you know, you start looking for shortcuts. You start looking for ways to get ahead that, you know, aren't always the best choices uh, for for what you're trying to do, right? You know, what what's the little Wayne line? Fast money don't last, honey, right? You know, and that's talking about the dope game, right? People will go and sell drugs because it's an easy, fast way to make money, and, you know, what's sad about that is, is the people that are doing that, that are running around, selling those bags of dope, making $5 here and $10 here because they think that's the hustle, they're risking their livelihood, they're risking their future to make minimum wage, right? And, and I know there are some guys out there that, that get in the dope game that make, you know, a couple thousand bucks a week and they're making six figures a year and, you know, of course, they're living the life, they're living flashy on that fast money. But again, they're risking their entire future. You know, they're dealing with criminals and people who are out to hurt them in order to make that fast money. So whatever game you're playing in life, just understand that it doesn't make sense to cheat to win, right? Because integrity-driven individuals, the kind of person you are, the kind of person you try to surround yourself with, people, people who actually want to help you get to that next level... Right? Those are the people who you want to be like. The guys that are in the dope game, that are running that fast money, they're, they're not going to make it forever. And those who have made it a long time will tell you that, you know, it ain't all it's cracked up to be. So just remember, you know, when you're playing the game, play to win, but don't ever cheat yourself to get there. Because whether you cheat and win, you won't be an integrity person, you know, integrity-driven person. And if you cheat and you don't win... How much is that going to suck? So think about that today, you guys. Play the game to win, but never cheat yourself to get there. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to go back and check out all the previous episodes. Make sure you subscribe and share this podcast with other like-minded, success-driven individuals who want to crush it. Check the show notes and grab your Crush of the Day swag over at crushingtheday.com. And remember, crush the day before it crushes you. You gotta crush the day before it crushes you.